Hey guys, so welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another video. If you are new, hey, my name is CJ. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to my madness and randomness. As promised, I have an unboxing video for you guys. It shouldn't take me that long to unbox these items. Actually, I've already done a reel on these two items on Instagram, but I wanted to go into a little detail about them and I've already worn them and so I got something to say about how they feel okay when I wore them so uh, once I do that I'll go through that little spiel then I want to style them in um, in a few ways you know just to add a little a little something to this video and then I will have another unboxing video but I'm not sure if I'm going to do it immediately after this one or if I'm gonna put something in between and then do that one but same method I'm gonna show you the items talk about them a little bit and then I'm gonna add a few styles so without further ado let's go ahead and get into this unboxing by the way I am filming in front of the window again with natural lighting and one thing about that Sun is she he it is gonna do what it wants to do when it wants to do it so if you see the lighting shift it's just the sun and i have no control over it but this is better than trying to fool with the artificial lighting that i have not been able to get together so i was like i'm not gonna waste time trying to adjust and get this natural i mean i'm sorry get this artificial light i'm just gonna work with the natural light and we're just gonna make it do what it do okay we're gonna make it do what it do all right so two items both of them are shoes and they are from Gucci. okay um the first pair i want to talk about and i had to write down the name is uh the gucci ace sneakers with back spikes and they also have pearls on them so again this pair came in a gucci shoe box and i got both of these from neiman's i of course got the shoe she actually gave me an extra set of um shoe pouches so i have two or four <laughs> i have four so got those they also come with extra sh uh shoelaces they just regular shoes shoelaces i know it has gucci on this little thing but that is gucci is not on the shoelaces okay so these are just regular white shoelaces and here are the beauties and i always stick the paper back in my shoes because i want them to you know keep the form but this is what they look like love 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 and that is the right shoe and then the left shoe is actually red so really really cute i love it i love it so that's what they look like and i've worn these so let's talk about it for a second so oh that's the bottom just in case it's not too dirty but you know you can see that i've worn them so this is that hard leather um and it says that it's made in italy it has gucci in that one yeah it's gucci in both but this is that hard there's that sun. Um, this is that hard leather. So they are not the most comfortable, but if you double up on your no-show socks, you should be good to go. The way I wear my um, sneakers is typically I'll tie them and then I will stuff the shoestring down over in the sides. And sometimes that will add to it not being as comfortable, but for the most part you see a lot of designer shoes with this hard leather um material do you even call it material <laughs> um so and and they're not as comfortable they are not as comfortable other than that you know they're okay like they're not completely uncomfortable but just note that if you get these and if you're interested in these um it is the hard leather it's not soft there's nothing soft about around the perimeter of your foot and so you'll have to try to achieve that with like i said 
either doubling up on a no-show sock or just giving it time to um, break in. And I'm hope I'm hoping eventually I'll break them in, you know, stretch them out a little bit and they will be good to go. And I won't have to double up on my no-show socks, but it's not a big deal for me to do that. So, and I have a pretty narrow foot. So, anywho, that's all I wanted to say about these. Um, I have also have some Prada shoes that I shared on Instagram as well. Same thing, and I have to double up on my no-show socks for those as well. So, yep, I got those. I love them, though. Yeah, I do not regret my purchase at all. I would buy these again, but just note that right there. The next pair came in the beautiful green box and packaging and these are the gucci tennis 1977 sneaker and these were like really and truly love at first sight so when i went into uh went to gucci or went to the gucci area those are not the the ace those are not the ace shoes that i really wanted i was going for the ones like with a platform i wanted a platform but she showed me those and i was like you know what i like that it has a little character you got the spikes on the back it's two different colors i like it i love it but i saw these and they come in these two dusk bags here and um i, I love these i was like okay yeah I know I'm going to be wearing these out to death, whatever you want to call it. Um, but these are the 1977 tennis. They are comfortable. Okay. Comfortable. They are comfortable. And I just love the style. It fits my narrow foot. And that's what the bottom looks like. I wore them. I actually wore them to uh, the festival. So I really need to clean them up. <laughs> uh, no, I do not baby these shoes, honey. You spend... You spend this money on them. Um, you do want to take care of them, but um, I'm, I'm not trying to baby anything that I buy. Okay, I buy it because I love it, and if I'm if if it's good quality, it should be able to endure whatever I got to give. Okay, um, so this is what they look like. Nothing spectacular, but you get the GG print and um, you know the infamous red and green stripe on both sides um and that's what they look like let me show you what they look like on the inside that's what it looks like on the inside it has the gucci in there and again i just really i need to clean them up because i would i wouldn't suggest wearing them to a festival but i did because i ain't skirt i ain't even skirt so yeah that is what those look like. And I do recommend these because they are super, super comfy. So let's go ahead and get into the next phase of this video, which will be me styling them in a few ways. So if you are interested in that part, stay tuned. If not, and if you have any questions, leave them in the comment section. Um, but without further ado, Let's get on into this styling, okay? 